Hello everyone, my name is Jason Garcia and today I will be showing my baby album. So let's go ahead and get started. This is Audrey's photo album, which is my first daughter. It is me and my wife's first daughter. And, you know, she chose the name Audrey and when I first heard it, I fell in love with it. We are both very young. We are both 19 years old and we definitely had our first baby earlier than expected. We didn't plan on having a kid until five, six years from now once we got our careers settled in. But we knew that abortion wasn't going to be an option and also we knew that adoption wasn't going to be an option. So so we had the, the, the kid. At first I was nervous. I've never really had experience with babies I've just never had the opportunity to deal with a human at that age but she has um, through her little sisters and and our both of our parents are very supportive and they have helped us a lot with the uh, with Audrey and I'm, I am I am very proud to say that that I am a a girl dad and I, and I want to be the best father in the world for my my little Audrey. I'll be moving to the next slide now. Whoops. I don't know why it's not moving. There you go. Sorry, technical difficulties there. Let's move on. Um, when it comes... Wait, I think I skipped. Sorry. We're back now. We're back in. We're back on track. Let's move on to the to Audrey's physical appearances. As we can see, three months in, she's wearing her her white shirt, not a lot of facial detail, and a single hair. Um, when I first saw her, it was one of the best moments of my life. Beautiful. Congratulations to my my wife, my beloved Stevie, for the the labor. As we can see in the eight month mark, um, we can see we can start to see facial detail as well as um, hair. And it's quite obvious. I mean, she has clearly inherited my eyes. We can see that my beloved Stevie over here has green eyes. She has also inherited my skin tone and um, the color of my hair. At the one year mark, her hair is starting to grow a little more. As well as, it is very clear that her favorite color is blue. My favorite color is also blue, which, which is why I chose the, the background and the whole present, the whole presentation to be blue. And I'm not surprised that Audrey has chosen the favorite color of her father. And she's she's a very beautiful. I am really happy to say that I am her dad, and overall, she seems she seems very healthy. I mean, physically, she she looks healthy. When it comes to gross and fine motor skills, Audrey is advanced in her gross and fine motor skills. When it comes to gross, one of the gross motor skills that Audrey has demonstrated is crawling. She is always finding new ways to explore her range of motion. It is very important that the humans at this age are curious about their environment and the doctor said that that is very good and we're going to continue to to expose her to a new environment um, maybe go to the backyard um, um, new places front yard and we're going to make sure that she continues to be curious to explore her range of motion and her overall body movement Another gross motor skill she has shown to do is pull herself up. When she pulls herself up, I find it very impressive because it's her whole body weight. You know, kids at this age don't really have muscles, but they're low in weight. But the reason why I find it impressive is when she pulls herself up, she's like hanging. So she's pulling her whole body weight. And she enjoys doing that. She likes it. Um, when it comes to fine motor skills... Hide and seek is an activity that Audrey has come to enjoy. I hide objects from her and looking for them is something that she likes to do. 
As she looks for them, she engages in picking up light objects and pushing light objects. You know, when when, we, when me and her play this game, I would hide something, for example, under the blanket. And she would always lift the blanket. But once I switched it on her, for example, instead of under the blanket, I put it next to a chair or behind a chair. She would always go back to the original position, which would be under the blanket. And then she would, you know, be confused, look around. I would give her a little hint. She would move to the to the chair, push the chair a little bit. And, and there you go. She would find the object. Next slide. So there is some developmental concerns, unfortunately. Um, no baby is perfect, and these are the issues that we've seen in Audrey. Firstly, Audrey often experiences indigestion and diarrhea, which I believe is a sign of a poor digestive system. Well, when Audrey was first born, the doctor said she was low in birth weight. But not by that much. She wasn't extremely low. But everything that I tried to find via research, I tried uh, the textbook from my child psychology class. I tried the web. Everything that is related to low birth weight is extreme. We're talking like low, really low birth weight. But Audrey wasn't really that low. So I don't. I'm not sure if this has if this has anything to do with that because she's also having trouble eating. And that's another concern. So, um, I'm not sure if that's the reason. But we've tried different foods. We've tried, um, we've like a combination of breastfeeding and baby formula. And still, still indigestion problems and diarrhea. We can see right here the diapers that my beloved Stevie's holding. And the brand of diapers that we use, Huggies. Very reliable brand not sponsored by Huggies. Another developmental concern me and my beloved Stevie have is um, Audrey often catches colds, which I believe is a sign of a weak immune system. This is concerning because we haven't really exposed her to a lot of people besides the grandparents and a lot of mucus. I mean, a lot of mucus, a lot of coughing, more than I am comfortable with. Um, Stevie also says that it's a concern because with the babies that she's dealt with, not a lot of colds. And it's something that we still have to do research on and talk to some doctors because we don't we do not want it to be anything serious because as we know, the health of a baby is by far the most important. But besides all of that, um I've had a really good experience. Um I'm trying to get better. I will be better and hopefully Audrey gets better. Thank you for listening to my uh, photo baby album. It was a pleasure to do this assignment. This link below will take you to the YouTube video. Thank you very much. This will conclude my presentation.